this kind of company began in 1956 with a guy named Fijian, who rented a floor and then subdivided it. Every single company in this space has gone broke. It, when you say in this we space, just, you mean taking long-term leases and then yeah, offering short-term rentals. Yeah, they just the name of the company to savings and loan. Yeah. I mean, that's really what you're talking about. You know, lending, you know, you know uh, creating long-term liabilities and short-term assets. Uh, every other time in history when they create that, the results are predictable. Why is this any different? Meaning that they are the first ones to go in a recession when things turn down. Well, I mean, I used to be the largest owner of, of container leases, containers in the world. I was the marginal container provider. So every shipping company owned half the containers they needed. Right. And the other half were leased from seven international companies. So those seven companies provided the marginal. When business was good, everybody did terrific. When business was bad, the marginal player lost, and the companies did fine. Do we think there'll never be another recession? Do we think there'll never be another oversupply of office space? Uh, this is marginal stuff, uh, and it's being priced and described as though it was some holy grail. And uh, it, it, it's very hard for me to understand the fact that the real estate industry as a whole has committed suicide by uh, allowing, give or take, 20 percent of its office space to be, uh, in effect, non-credit makes no sense to me whatsoever either. Mm -hmm. So uh, do you think the industry is committing suicide by, by even working with them? To the extent they did. I mean, it's OK if you have a, a corner or you have a WeWork space or a co-working space. We're talking about 20. They're the largest landlord in New York, right. London, et cetera. Well, what, what happens? You know, you've got so one. So what's the chance they've become too big to fail? Well, that's a different story. In other words, the question because, becomes. Right. They own well, so but, much space that when, when, yeah, but, when the but true if, downturn happens. Yeah, but if you're too big to fail, what happens is you can't make your payments. Right. You can't make your payments. You therefore go back to the landlord and say, gee, I'm sorry, I yep. can't make my payments. Change the rent. <laughs> that doesn't do a lot for the equity holder. It may protect the bond holder. Maybe. Maybe.